guys. So, today's Monday, aka peak week, which is meaning the week before my show, aka the worst week of my life because I have to eat the same stuff over and over and over again. And it's tiring and I'm tired and I'm tired physically, I'm tired, um, like, I guess emotionally. I don't know, I'm just tired, I'm drained, like, the show takes a lot out of you. And I'm low on calories, and I'm just like, I'm over it, and I'm ready for it to be over. Chance is crying, he's about to take a nap. But, uh, I'm on my second gallon. I've already drank one whole of these, one whole, um, of these things, one gallon of this. And now I'm down to here. Um, sorry, I got a text message. Uh, and I found my expel at Vitamin Shop this morning. I probably have a water mustache. Uh, this is what I have to take. Diuretic, and it helps with rapid water loss. Um, and, uh, extreme muscle defining. Basically, it takes the water, like, from underneath your skin so you don't look puffy, basically. And I'm supposed to take that, uh, up until Friday? Friday. Um... So, I'm about to go to the gym. I think I'm going to wake Jaden up because he loves to go to the daycare and play with the kids there. Um, and if y'all are wondering, I don't wear my my ring to the gym because I know some of y'all are going to ask. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to wake him up and see if he wants to go to the daycare with me. I mean, to the gym with me. Hey, Jaden. Jaden. Jay. Jaden. I know it's probably mean to, for me to wake him up, but if he wakes up and I'm not here, he's gonna cry. Like, I wanna go play with the kids. Jaden, honey, Jay, Jay, Jaden. Goodness gracious. Jaden, do you wanna go play with the kids at the gym? Jay, he's, he's drooling. Hey, Jay, do you wanna go play with the kids? Do you want to go play with the kids, honey? Maybe I should let him sleep. He usually doesn't take this long to wake up. Jaden, do you want to go play with the kids? Hey, Jay. Jaden, do you want to go play with the kids? Do you want to go play with the kids at the gym? Okay, well, maybe not. <clears throat> Chance is down for a nap. He's crying, but uh, he should go to sleep soon. Where are you going? Just put on some pants so I can be shown on the vlog. Oh, you, um... No, you can walk around naked. You huh? want to tell them what you did? Yesterday you told me you didn't have no Tupperware in your car. I had one Tupperware. And you had a Tupperware in your car. I had one. We found the Tupperware monster. You are the Tupperware thief. It was thief. one. I told you. It was one. I told you. It don't matter if it was half a one. It was still one it's in there. two, but I just wanted to make Oh, okay. Like so you had two. Sure. <sighs> he's, he's really sleepy. He should fall asleep soon. But if he keeps crying, just get him up. It's a crappy day outside. It's raining. Let's see. Our deck. Uh, yeah, I'm going to um, try to wake him up one more time. Then I'm going to go to the gym. And my battery's dying on my camera, so I need to charge that. He woke up and he decided to come. You tired? Get your hands off your pants. You wanna go play? Yeah. Why? So we're about to go. So I need to tell TJ the story, but I need to, to tell y'all too. So um, when I went to go pick Jaden up. Wait, you gonna tell me again how you tell him? Yes. So I'll have to repeat it. But anywho, when I went to, um, look at how cute this little baby is. Hello. Hi, cutie pie. Hey. Hi. Uh, so when I went to the kid zone, to the, the kid zone at the gym where Jaden was, to pick him up, I didn't see him in there. He wasn't in there. So I was like, where's Jaden? And, um, my heart just was like pounding. And then, like, the director lady, she was like, um, she told me that another director went to go get her. She was like, she was like, um, she went, she went to go get her. And I was like, 
her. I'm like, you mean him? So I'm freaking out. I'm like, okay, so they, they think that I have a daughter that's about mine, <clears throat> and they didn't give Jaden to somebody else. So um, I forgot that they had, you know, that the you know the kids zone area across where there's another place not place but room where the kids can play with Daddy. balls and stuff <clears throat> so um but when she said her i felt like you know he wasn't going to be in there so i rushed like out of the room to go to go see if he was there and he was there but i'm already low in calories like i probably i was liable to pass out like i felt sick to my stomach like i had a vomit i could hear my heartbeat through my chest i was shaking I was scared. I thought somebody had been kidnapped my kid. It was scary. It was scary. You go into daycare and you think your kid's there and I'm, you're looking around and you don't see him at all. And then they say, oh, they went to get her. <laughs> what do you mean her? I don't have a daughter. Did you say that to I was like, you mean him? And she looked weird at first. And she was like, oh, I thought she said her. Uh, it was scary, but anyway, um, I uh, I'm I'm tired. I feel like I should just go to sleep since I can't eat any fat food. This kid didn't take a nap. You didn't take a nap. What are you doing? What you doing? Your cr your legs look crazy. <laughs> what round of picture? Oh yeah. That's how you like. Did you have fun in the kid zone? Yes. You did? I play kids. You play with the kids? Well, what did you do in there with the kids? Mm. Why in the floor like that? Butt up on the, in the air. What did you do with the kids? I play kids. You played with the kid well, you played with the balls and the yes. toys? Yes. Did you go outside? Yes. No, you didn't. You didn't go. You didn't go outside. It was raining. Oh, I... My battery's about to die again. I never charged it before I left. I need to charge it. What'd you say? I'm a storyteller. You're a storyteller. Let me see you do some push-ups. One, two, do them right. Three. Do them right. Four. You're not doing them right. Chance in the background. What he doing? Seven. Eight. Nine. Chance. Ten. Eleven. Mm-hmm. Then do I have push-ups? <laughs> then do I have push-ups? Yeah. Chance trying. He copies everything Jaden does. He copied me. He copying you. Yes. He is. He copied me. <laughs> he copied me. All right. Good morning, you guys. Um, I still didn't charge my battery yesterday, like I said I was supposed to. But um, as you can see, I probably look so freaking tired. But um, I'm tired because, well, one, um, when I put Chance in the crib last night, he jumped out of the bed of the crib. <clears throat> so uh, I put him in Chance's little bed. Not Chance's little bed. Um, Jaden's little toddler bed. Let me show you guys that real quick. Because Jaden got a new bed. He got a twin size bed. And so the, we just moved his other bed over here. So Chance slept in there all night last night. But I was anticipating him waking up in the middle of the night. Like Jaden, because when Jaden started, we, when he first started sleeping in the bed, he would wake up, you know, a few times. And I would have to put him back to sleep. So that's what I anticipated Chance doing. But he didn't. He slept all night. Um, but I just felt like he was going to get up. So, you know, I didn't put myself, like, in a deep sleep like I felt like, you know, I could have. Um, and then, I don't know, mommies probably know what I'm talking about if you're a mom. But I kept hearing, let's make sure my battery's not dying. I kept hearing um, his cry in my sleep. But he wasn't crying. I just heard him, like my brain just was like hearing him cry. So I'd wake up and like see if he was like in my room and stuff or see if he was like crying and he wasn't. So he slept all night in the toddler bed. I'm so proud of him. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to keep keep him in there. Um, you know, to get him used to sleeping in the toddler bed. And, and plus I don't want him getting injured in the crib, jumping out of the crib anymore. Um, 
Mommy. But yeah, to, uh, I just am so tired. I'm hungry. I'm about to eat my breakfast, but um, stop, Jaden. Um, say good morning. Good morning. Did you finish and your breakfast? I still see food over there. Go eat your strawberries. Go eat. Go eat your strawberries. Um, so yeah, I'm 118 pounds this, this morning. Um, I'm trying to get down, down to down to 115 by the end of the week for my show. But with, with my expel up here that I showed y'all yesterday and depleting everything, I should get there. So we'll see. I'm just drained and uh, just over it. It's like a crappy day outside, so that doesn't make any it, it make it any better. Um, TJ already left for work, so I need to yeah get these boys ready and take them to their papa's house and get ready to go to work. So I just wanted to share with, that with y'all this morning before I left. Hey guys, I'm home now. I have a something in my throat. Anyway, uh, I'm about to eat my second fish and broccoli. Oh, I'm so sick of this food. Cannot wait for this weekend to be over. Um, so was, I meant to tell you guys, well, tomorrow I was going to do a vlog and tell you guys that, um, you want a snack chance? Tell you guys that I was going to be like a part-time stay-at-home mom again because originally my my boss wanted to, um, hold on, I'm trying to get to change the snack. He, here, you go. You don't want it? Well, what do you want? Hold on, y'all. Okay, so originally my boss wanted wanted to um, wanted me to work less. Uh, I think like two to three days a week um, because he wants to open another company and he wants he wanted to save money basically. But um, now we had got we had got like a bunch of new clients and then the other lady that um, works in the office one of the other ladies that works in the office is leaving. So now. Um, he wants my hours to stay the same now. So now I won't be a stay-at-home part-time, part-time stay-at-home mom or whatever, um, which I'm kind of sad about because originally I was sad about my hours being cut, but then I was happy about it because I was like, yeah, I get to stay home again. Um, but now I'm sad about going back, or not going back, but my hours being the same because I was excited about staying home. So yeah, it's all right. And I, you know, I just is excited to, you know, be able to vlog more and do more videos and be home with the boys. But it's okay. Um, it's all good. I mean, my hours are still awesome. Like I like my my hours, ten to three every day, uh, Monday to Friday, and off weekends. So that's not bad at all. But I should be able to do more because after my show, I won't have to do like you know my hardcore training and stuff like that. I can be home more once I get off work, you know. But. Um, I just wanted to share that with you guys. I have like something in my throat. <clears throat> but I need to eat my food. I have legs today. So let's see. I have legs today. I think I still never charge my battery and it's still. <laughs> I keep saying that. But my battery, my charger's in my car and every time I get out I forget to get the get the charger. But today I have legs. I worked out yesterday. Tomorrow we have back and biceps I think. And then Thursday I have shoulders. Friday I don't work out at all. We actually go to where the um, show is going to be down uh, TJ's parents' house, I have to take my polygraph and stuff like that. And then Saturday is the show, and I will be vlogging it for you guys to see. So um, you guys will definitely see the show. Say hi, Funkin' Bud! Say hi, Funkin' Bud! I'm waiting for TJ to get home. I need to do the dishes and eat and change so I can go to the gym and be back home early, not late at night. What, you wanna pick you up? I pick you up. Go to. We already discussed this. 